question number 13 the figure below shows triangle xyz so the triangle is there using a ruler and a pair of compasses locate a point m on the triangle such that m is 2 cm from line yx and is equidistant from line yx and yz measure length ym so let us begin by locating this point m such that m is 2 cm from line yx m is 2 cm from line yx how do you draw that just take a pair of compass and um, take measurement of 2 cm so let me take 2 cm so that is 2 cm so with that measurement you stand at y standing at y uh, mark an arc with the 2 cm mark an arc there so with the same same go to x and uh, construct another arc like that then after doing that uh, take a runa and join draw a line that touches uh, the top of these arcs like these are uh, the way we draw the tangents So that line should touch uh, the top of these arcs uh, the way we draw the tangents like that now that line is uh, two centimeters from yx now you notice that to draw to construct that um, the locus of that point m such that m is two centimeters from line yx it is um, a line that is parallel to yx and the distance between the two lines is 2 cm so you notice that uh, this line line yx is parallel to this line that you've drawn here and the distance between the line uh, the two lines is 2 cm so that is how we construct so m is 2 cm from that line yx and um, that is a pair of parallel lines the two parallel lines whereby the distance between them is two centimeters now that is the first then uh, some more information here we're supposed to and also that point um, the second statement here and is equidistant the same m is equidistant from line yx and yz so we are supposed to construct the locus of a point equidistant from these two lines line yx and line yz to construct um, the locus of a point equidistant from two sides that means it is the angle bisector between the two lines i repeat that that the locus of a point equidistant from two lines is the angle bisector between the two lines so in this case these lockers uh, that are supposed to, con to construct that is equidistant from lines yx and yz simply means it is the angle bisector that is made by those two lines and that angle is angle x y z x y z is the angle that you're going to bisect so to bisect that angle just take a pair of compass uh, within the radius you stand at the angle that is supposed to construct that is between the two lines is that angle x y z so with any radius you yeah, with any radius you mark an arc there then another arc another arc there then you stand on this arc you made here then with uh, any radius there you 
make a big arc there then you stand on the other arc then cut that arc that is how we bisect an angle then take a runa and join draw a line so the line should pass through So that is the bisector. So that is the bisector of angle x, y, z, and that is the locus of a point equidistant from line y, x, and x, z, y, x, and y, z. Now, which is this point? The point M, therefore, is the intersection of these two locus. The first locus is uh, the one that we constructed. That is two centimeters from line y x that line that is parallel to y x then the second one is the angle bisector that we have, we've just constructed and where are they meeting they're meeting at this point so this is the point and that is uh, the location of m so that is how we're supposed to do that we're supposed to measure the length y m the length y m so let me measure the length y m So to measure length the ym, we stand here. You can take a ruler as well, or you can take that distance using a pair of compasses and transfer that. So mine is giving um, missing. That is uh, 4.1 as you can see my pair of compasses uh, has the measurement of that line so this one is a uh, 4.1 centimeters so ym so therefore ym ym is 4.1 centimeters and that's how we're supposed to solve that question